watched Brian Balaga tonight. Dan Koob is live from the sidelines at Lambeau Field with what it means for the game, Dan. That's right, Stacey. Injuries, of course, a big part of playing in the National Football League. The Packers continue to have to fight through them. Earlier this week, losing inside linebacker Sam Barrington for the rest of the season with an ankle injury. And then Thursday, right tackle Brian Balaga leaves practice early. His third knee injury in as many seasons. Now, initially believed to just be an MCL sprain, but uh, NFL Network reported yesterday he had surgery on a torn meniscus that will keep him out at least a month. His replacement tonight figures to be Don Barclay, who in the preseason didn't put very good tape down while he recovered from an ACL tail last year. Mike McCarthy non-committal for a starter earlier in the week. But as uh, Barclay, odds are he is the guy, and the timing of Balaga's injury couldn't be much worse going against a Seahawks front that sacked Rodgers 13 times in the last three meetings. It's Thursday practice during an individual drill, and but uh, you know it's football. It's unfortunate, and uh, you know we'll deal with it. I think everybody goes through camp and, and makes makes you know progress, uh, whether whether you're you know early in your career, or coming off injury. So I, I think Donnie is uh, taking a normal path coming off of an ACL injury. Um, he's he is lined up and played and and played well for us, you know. So you know, J.C. Treader is a heck of a football player, so. You know, I, I like all of our guys. This is, of course, familiar territory for Barkley. If he does indeed line up a right tackle, back in 2013, he made 14 starts at the same position when Blaga tore his ACL in the Packers' family night scrimmage. Stacy.